Kids, how are ya? My name is Danielle Breezy and I'm the Chief Meteorologist at News 2. I'm so excited to be coming to you virtually for your career day. So I wanna talk a little bit about my career. First of all, I start my day at 1.30 in the afternoon. I bet you already ate lunch, I'm just waking up. But I go until about 10.30, 11 o'clock at night when most of you are sleeping with a 10 o'clock broadcast, you know. And if we do have any crazy weather, I can stay all night long or start very early in the morning. So it all depends on what is going on. If one of my team members are off, I even work the weekends at times. All right, so to talk about what you have to do in order to be a meteorologist, well, you have to go to school for it. It's a science and math degree. So if you like science and math and you want to be a broadcast meteorologist, you got to also be comfortable with talking in front of people like I'm doing right now. Now, what do I love most about my job? Well, I'll tell you this much. No two days are the same from when we have tornado weather to when we have snow weather. It's always a challenge to forecast for here in Middle Tennessee and Southern Kentucky. But the other thing is I get to come to schools, well, virtually now, but I also get to do a whole lot of other things like events in the community and help support local organizations. What do I love most or not like most about my job? Uh, I will tell you, I think it is working weekends at times. Remember the weather does not go to bed at night, so it can happen in the middle of the night. So you might be a little bit tired and you'll still be on TV at three in the morning. And also uh, the fact that weather doesn't stop on Christmas. It doesn't stop on Thanksgiving. So we all have to work a bunch of things. And in case you didn't know this, for a meteorologist, you actually have to move around the country. So I've worked in all different markets like Boston, Oklahoma, Texas, Maryland, and I'm from Philadelphia originally, and now I'm here in Nashville, but I love it there. Um, what is the reasonable salary range for someone just starting out? Unfortunately, television is not the highest paying job. I would say my first job, I think, was between 25, 30,000 a year, but it does get better as you get more mature in your field. So just keep pushing forward, it'll be okay. And remember, as long as you love what you're doing, you'll never work a day in your life. That's really my advice for you. Make sure you follow your dreams and do something you love. It is so, so important. And remember to follow me too while we're remembering this Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, just Danielle Breezy TV. By the way, I want to conclude this video with a tour of our station. So I'm sitting in front of the band here, okay? And this is actually where I do some of my weather broadcasts. But as you can see, this is actually where the anchors hang out and they do the news right here. This is our studio. Now, if you come with me back this way, I'll show you that this is actually my home away from home. This is where I spend most of my days in my weather center. We have weather computers that we use. We have a regular computer where I do my forecasts on every day for you. So we do produce our own graphics here too, by the way. And I don't read the words off a teleprompter. In fact, I talk off the top of my head, whether it's five seconds, 30 seconds, a minute. <gasps> you want to come back and see where I talk off my head from? Come on back here. This is what we call the green screen, and this is where the magic happens. And you can see, look at this. I can look to my left, I can look to my right. I might've said the direction wrong, but you can see yourself on TV, but when you're looking at it in here, it's just a green wall. And this is where I do my weather every night at four, five, six, and 10. So make sure you tune in and thanks for joining me. Have a great rest of your career day.